Hey guys and welcome back on my YouTube channel, it's your boy Troll and in today's video we're gonna continue on Awaken Chaos Era and what I want to do today is to push my challenges. So for those who were playing before, uh, obviously those were different and even if you finish them from what I can see, you can finish them again and you can get some pretty nice rewards, even Urion. But I don't think I will be able to fully finish them. I think like for example event challenge or or event challenge will be the hardest one to finish. Because obviously it depends on the events you have right now. But we're gonna start slowly progressing one by one. And we can see, I want to see basically, how much free stuff you're gonna get. So I have been playing a little bit. I finished the basic one. Obviously it was very easy. Then once you finish the basic you can progress to advanced. And the last reward is summons. You get a lot of summons to be quite honest. And then I want to see what's the expert and obviously finish it. So let me progress a little bit. I will see if I, if I have any difficulties in doing this. But if not I will find you back once I am on expert. And let's see what do we get from the expert. Now, also something that is worth mentioning, in Awaken Chaos Era, basically they introduced the back background battle, multi-battle. So, why I am farming, let's say, a content, any content, I don't know, uh, Ash or Campaign or whatever. Basically, you launch a 10 multiple battle. In the meantime, you can do whatever else you want. The only restraint is that you cannot use the heroes you are using in the multiple battle. So for example, I have 10 multiple battles going on. As you can see, those heroes are being used in the multiple battle. However, I can do whatever else I want manually just by using other heroes. So not only at the same time I can progress in the campaign adventure challenge, as you can see, we're gonna basically we're farming right now here. And at the same time, I can progress into the arena battle because this is something I can do while uh, I'm fighting in the multiple battles to get some loot or progress in a stage. So it's really, really nice. And to be quite honest, the reward from the arena one, even on the basic one, is really nice because this, this thing will basically help you to uh, progress your max level on any character. So obviously this is a very nice reward. So let's me jump in, try to finish both at the same time and I'll find you once we are done. Okay guys, so we are back right now. Uh, we are about to finish the advanced path of growth. So let's see what are now the rewards of the expert mode. So we're gonna get again a lot of summons, gear enchantment, diamonds also. And a legendary book. Okay. So that was a little bit unexpected. Before we had a five, a five star summon crystal. Now it's a legendary book. And I'm guessing the legendary books are way better now. Because they are more rare. Uh, so let me try to finish it. I don't think I'm going to have a big problem. It's mostly adventure. It is literally only adventure. Okay, so I think I'm going to finish it. That's really nice. It really pushes you to finish the campaign. Which even before was the best thing to do in this game. Literally finishing and pushing the campaign. Uh, unlocking stages with better quality glyphs and more glyphs. That was always the thing to do to go for. And now they made it just very clear that they want you and the game pushes you. To basically push the campaign when you're a new player. So yeah, that's that's really that really makes sense now. So yeah, we're gonna see, I think, yeah, basically it's gonna be Finnish Mythic Campaign. Now, finishing Mythic Campaign will be a little bit challenging, especially if you're starting the game right now. Uh, but, oh, complete Adventure Stage 6-8 within 10 rounds. Okay, let's go and do it. 6-8. Okay, let me do it and I, fin I find you with the Legendary Book. Okay, so we are done with Path of Growth, and now we get our legendary book. That's it? Okay, so this one is now completed. Ooh, 10 summons! That's nice. I, I, ha I have noticed. I thought it was one summon for some reason. Uh, so, now we're gonna try and finish Arcan Do Arcane Dominator. So this is the yeah this is the gear you want to try to get as soon as possible. This will be your first six star legendary gear. Uh, so yeah, let me try to get twenty pieces of 
elite or better gear from Ark and Dominator. Wow, really? Okay. Okay, guys, uh, let me go through this because there'll be just a lot of farming. And while I'm farming this, I will also do some arena. So I will see you in a second. Okay, so we did progress a little bit in the arena one. Now I basically need to farm gear, apparently, with speed. <laughs> so this will take some time. Uh, both of them, actually. Start better bits with main speed stints, yeah. So I will keep those for now till I have my proper team. For the Arcane Dominator, it's the same. I need to farm 5 star and above, etc. So I'm gonna keep those for now till I get a proper Ash Hell 4 team. Once I can start farming Ash uh, 16, 18, I don't even know. I think it's 16 now. Once I can do the 16 one, we're gonna do that. For the hero development, what do we have here? Is there anything? Oh, we have upgrading heroes, equipment gear, inlay glyphs, promote hero. Let's try this one actually. Complete 10 adventure stage hard with double XP. Okay, let's let's do this. Let, let me actually push this one. It, it looks easier. It doesn't involve me building an actual proper team for now. Uh, so yeah, let's go to hard, do that. And I will find you once I finish this one. Okay, well, that's a boomer. Uh, basically, to continue, I need elite books, which I just don't have. <laughs> so I literally cannot progress any further. Upgrade mastery upgrades. I'm gonna need plenty of books actually. Epic hero, epic mastery, glyphs, upgrade heroes, and the glyphs. So, yeah, I'm gonna need some books to, in order to finish this tree. Uh, but you know what? Since we got some nice summons, let's actually go and some, do some summons. I mean, after all, all this grinding was not for nothing. Uh, so, yeah, let's jump into the summons. Okay, so we have a nice hundred summons. Uh, let's see if we can get any lucky and get a legendary. Obviously, ideally dark and light and ideally new one. Oh, well, <laughs> hell, hello. We can. Yes, you can. What do we get? Pluto. No, I already have him. No. There's so many champions I'm missing. <laughs> okay. Well, I doubt I can get... Uh... I mean, technically speaking, we can still get lucky. Let's see. Back to back. Who knows? No, no. But we are still missing some epic heroes as well. So I will not say no to new epic heroes. So stop giving me old epic heroes and give me some new epic heroes. Antwina is needed for Queen 16, I saw. There's a team with her. I already have her full, but Antwina is a good hero. Okay, nothing special. Uh, okay. Also, uh, from my understanding, crunching uh, heroes to get jelly XP and stuff like that is a good option as well. Uh, Arendel, no, old heroes. Viola, okay. That's, I don't know if it's new. I mean, it is a new for me, technically speaking, because I haven't seen this hero when I was playing. But I already have her, apparently, so... No big deal. Let's see, let's continue. What's new? Come on, just, like, for the video, give me another one. Hel Helmar. If I'm not mistaken, he's still completely useless, right? Nothing changed with him. I don't think bleed teams became relevant. <coughs> I mean, I didn't see any specific videos with them or something, so. Uh, Roslyn. Ah, there you go. A new one. Finally. New one. What do you do? Deals damage and also gains 4 rage if the targets hold low. Upon reaching full rage, consume all rage to deal to a random enemy. Each activation increases this ability damage. I got that. Ooh. Okay. Deals to an enemy and gains one rage. Gains one rage if the attack triggers critical strike. Oh, okay. Sounds like she can hit. But uh, I doubt she's meta or something. Let's see. Ah, still not taxed. Then still not legendary. <laughs> Zachary. So that was a big discovery for me when I came back. Zachary became an epic hero. Epna is an old one. But why did he become an epic? 
the enemies do more damage to the deals. They didn't change anything, right? The enemy plus no deals no. It's not it only means that yeah it they didn't change why is it he a uh, epic hero now it makes him harder to build because you need to book him etc i really don't understand why they went from an elite to an epic with him oh, come on just give me that give me the double gold roslyn again okay okay we get you we got you come on is there a chance to get a double legendary come on let's do it let's do it no we don't do it <laughs> Zachary <laughs> bro stop it okay so we have six percent I mean let's see I doubt we can do it I I don't know I don't feel that lucky but maybe please come on come on please uh, oh, God, no nope uh Mognar Crixus, okay. Okay, okay, where are we? So we need seven summons. I mean, technically, we can try to get him. Let's see, let's do one by one and see if this can be done. Nope. Okay, let's buy everything. Let's buy everything and I'm gonna have no gems. That's for the content. <laughs> let's see. Let's see if we can get lucky and hit the pity or not. I mean, I think so. No, five. Ah, technically speaking, technically speaking, we might not get it. We might not get it. Okay, not here. Okay, so it's a golden circle. Now, is it the legendary? Yes, it is. And it's... Oh, Fahim, new one. Yes, I take it. What do What do you do? What do you do? Where are you? No, go away, go away. Go away. Go away. <laughs> uh, Fahim Index. Ah, oh, no, that's you. Okay, never mind. Well, I'm still gonna take your gems. Okay. Uh, where is Fahim? Here. Here you are. Okay, Fahim. Are you any good? Let's take the gems first of all. I mean, the skill and everything, it's really nice. It's kind of like a Virgil vibe. Uh, Starcraft Virgil vibe, yeah. What is this? So, grants attack up, then deals 160 damage to an enemy, inflicting massacre mark on the target for one turn. Launch joint attack to the target in allies' turn. Okay. Plus 35% damage dealt when attacking a new target enemy. Reduce the cooldown of the ultimate ability by two turns. Okay. It is five, okay. Deals 90% damage to an enemy. Launches a bonus attack with this character's basic ability. Upon dealing damage to a target with less than 30% health remaining. Grants one stack of invisibility to self at the start of the turn. Remove invisibility when taking attack of launch squad to attack with basic ability to up to once per three rounds. Okay. What the invincibility? Hmm. I don't know. Uh, I don't think he's like PvE meta, maybe PvP. But launch joint attack to the target in our last turn. And and this is forever? No, this is for one turn. So basically, he's gonna apply this, I guess. And whenever one of my other allies attacks, he will attack on him as well. Okay. Okay. Uh, nothing exciting. Obviously, Dark and Light is way more exciting. But we have some achievements. Ooh, 300k jelly. We take this. We know we need plenty okay guys so that's it from me from yeah from me today uh, i'm gonna keep pushing campaign and, and basically try to push the challenge i might do the void tower elite squad clear one floor of the void tower using heroes with 4000 attack plus okay this is kind of easy what's wow you get another one here what's this clear void tower hard three times oh my god and this 
clear with our heart okay this is doable but three times well i won't be able to do it straight away i will be able to do it in three months basically <laughs> uh no man's land what's this elementals we only get gems I won't be able to do it now anyway. Guild battle, advanced challenge. Storm duel, heal enchantment. We got two chosen faction. Oh, what's this? If you want to get another girl. Okay. Where do we get those? Qualis chest. Is it only from events? Collect stars. Get 400 stars in chosen factions. Okay okay i will have a look at this and yeah guys i will see you in the next video to make sure as always to like follow and subscribe and yeah i'm back to pushing i need to finish my ash team anyway guys ciao have a nice day